ว่าwalk out into the Coliseum right now as if I was a spectator watching the games <laughs> oh my god Oh my goodness. I gotta go find my group now. I separated from them. Alright. Right through there is where they would come out <clears throat> into, the, into the arena amongst a couple thousands of fans. Wow, it would have been absolutely amazing to hear all those people yelling and screaming. Absolutely amazing. This definitely would be prime seating right here. Definitely the highlight of this leg of the trip. Definitely being seeing the Coliseum. Some steps. down there where the games were held they actually used to fill that with water and reenact naval battles which is just unbelievable I found out where the Emperor would sit if he came to watch the games right there Right where the piece of the wall is missing, where the yellow, you see the little yellow lines, he would sit right there in that missing piece of the wall. But, which is so cool because each level represents uh, a class of people. For example, where the emperor would sit. Right here, more the upper class, and the higher you went, the poorer you were. You were. So if you were sitting up there, you were pretty poor.
Well, we're taking off. It's definitely probably been an amazing experience seeing this. This is the Roman Forum. Yeah, man. That. That's, that's the intensity we rocks, like. Rocks are awesome. You see? You see, don't you wish just like all the students were like that in history class with that intensity? Well, like Sarah said, it's the Roman Forum. Forum. Where they train gladiators for the games. But can't quite see it, but there's writing there. Well, it cleared up a little bit. It's not raining anymore. Uh, actually, it turned out to be a pretty beautiful day. It's nice, nice and cool. I say about high 60s, low 50, you know, high 60s, mid 60s or whatever. But definitely uh, an amazing day so far. Going from the Coliseum to this. <laughs> Dude, it's part of parkour. Part of it. It's part of parkour. I mean, I Dennis feel like is. Get, it's getting it's over this fence and then over this wall. I have a feeling there's a sudden drop over that fence right there. But. Call Sam. I think they're going down over the side. Alright, well. I'm standing in the middle of Circus Maximum. This is uh, where they used to do chariot races. See, so, yeah, I would be on the one side, the chariot would be coming towards me. And right on the other side of this knoll is the one just like it where they would come down. Over towards this way is the Roman Forum, and over there is the Colosseum. Definitely an amazing day. It started out just terrible with the rain. There's my fellow people. My minions. UN flag. There's the Coliseum. Lit up at night. <clears throat> awesome. It's absolutely amazing to see that at night. Probably the best part of being in Rome is was going to the Colosseum by far. <clears throat> I was so mad. 
we're walking around the Coliseum to see the the whole thing, what it really looks like at night. That is really cool how they have the lighting up there. Something else I noticed during the day, I have to walk over here to show you how you can get, see the full size of the whole Coliseum. <clears throat> like there's pieces of it missing. Honestly, you can see how each set there's, there's a section. There's two sections that are missing off of it. Like here's the one section, and then here's a second section. So that just gives you an idea that it was it was much bigger than what it is now. It stretched out to the sidewalk. So. Roman form, form is over here where we we were here over here earlier today. 